absolute maximum and minimum find the absolute maximum and minimum value of the function g of x equals to 2 times x to the power of 4 minus 8x cubed plus 8x square where x is between minus 1 and 3 and both are included in this interval so whenever you have a closed interval then there is a possibility of both absolute maximum and minimum so that could happen at these points or at the critical number so let's first find the critical number as you remember the critical number is a number where the function could be zero or undefined right so let's first find the derivative of the function which is g dash x equals to 4 times 2 8 x cubed minus 3 times 8 24 x square plus 18 x now let's simplify this we can take we can take two common here just 2 x could be common and then we are left with 4x square minus 12x plus 9 and we should now factor this now this seems to be a perfect square right 3 square and this is 2x whole square and the center term is minus 2 times 3 and 2x so we can write this as 2x uh, 2x time minus 3 whole square right so that is the factored form and now from here we can find the critical numbers right so let's find critical numbers so critical numbers are the numbers where g dash x is equals to zero or undefined now in this case g dash x cannot be undefined but it can be zero so it is equal to zero at x equals to zero when this term is zero or at x equals to 3 over 2. So you equate these two separately to 0 and solve for x. So these are your critical numbers, correct? Now when we have critical numbers, then we can find absolute maximum and minimum. And the criteria is find the value of the function at the critical numbers, which are in this case 0 and 3 by 2. And also find the value of the function at the given closed interval and that is g of minus 1 and g of 3 right so you need to find all these values using your calculator correct so use your calculator and find these values once you find these values then compare which is the maximum and which is the minimum so let's figure it out so if i put in 0 here in my function i get 0 so that is 1 3 by 2 is like 1.5 so let me put 1.5 and then calculate so I have uh, the function is 2x to the power of 4 so I'll put 2 within brackets 1.5 to the power of 4 minus 8 within bracket 1.5 to the power of 3 plus 9 within bracket 1.5 to the power of 2 equals to 3 3 by 8 which I could write in decimals 3.375 375 similarly plug in minus 1 and then calculate the power minus 1 is easier the other way so we'll say 2 and minus 1 will make it plus 8 and minus 1 will make it 9 so we get this as 19 and if you plug in 3 here so maybe we go with the calculator plus 9 within bracket 3 square equals to 27 so that gives us 27 so we have these values the values at the critical number and at the extreme points right so when you compare these values what do you notice you find amongst these values maximum is at 3 and the minimum is at 0 so that that gives us our answer right so now we can write down our answer and the question here is find absolute maximum and minimum value of the function right so we say maximum value is maximum value is we can write value right we are not giving the point but we are giving maximum value is 27 and minimum value 
is 0 for the function and it knew 27 is at x equals to 3 and minimum value is at x equals to 0. So this is 3 for us, right? So that is how we can do this question. Thank you.